short review of the bus or bus. There, the Part of the friends, 12.5 percent alcohol and contains so far. This is cheap as Oh my, it has gas. It has gas, <coughs> it had smoke. Well, I hope it has smoke. Is it this is not really chilled, it was chilled by. Oh, I can tell. Take a look at balance. I can tell you. I can tell you one thing. French sparkling wine is exploding. Exploding in tons of bubbles. That's actually a light. That's what I like about French sparkling wine. Take a look at bubbles. It's tons and tons of bubbles. Exploding, ex really exploding bubbles. Tons of bubbles. Killing bubbles, take a look. It's really killing, it's, this is killing exploding bubbles. That's what I like about French. Sparkling wine. If you look at some Spanish bubbles, some, some, some are okay, but if you look at Italian, uh, take a look at this. It's not about the glass, it's not about anything. It's about the French sparkling wine. Still, still. I keep talking, take a look. It's tons and tons of bubbles. I turn around, take a look at tons of bubbles. Tons and tons of bubbles. I talked for a really pretty long time. Like, tons and tons of bubbles. I keep, take a look. This fine sparkling wine. Uh, so Spanish or uh, Italian, it might not be that sparkling. I don't like Spanish taste, but the bubble wine, I like French. French put more bubbles. That's what you have. That's what you should do. Tons and tons of bubbles. Take a look. I hit, I hit one time. Take a look. Tons and tons of bubbles. Just from the one glare. Take a look.
I think actually Spaniards should learn how to make so much bubbles. It's still going, thank God, it's still going. It's not about the glass, everybody is talking, it's a glass, this is, it's the company. Take a look. Keep going. I did not do anything. Okay, I hit second time. I hit second time. This to the table. Look. So much bubbles. So tons and tons of bubbles. To me, that's how the sparkling wine should be. Tons and tons of bubbles. Yeah, this is not cheap taste. This is not cheap taste. This cost, let me see. I have a receipt. This is not cheap taste. So that was the bus, bus. The bus. Fifteen ninety nine. Yeah. I got four bottles. Uh, uh, I got four. The bus that I said. Fifty-nine. It's close to the phone. Fifty-nine. This way better than American. $22, 21 dollars. Ballast, because it's still going. It's going already for like a few minutes. It's not about the glass or anything, it's about the company. So, I think the bus is the longest bubbles I've seen. Actually, I like it. I like it. I think for $16 is one of the best purchases. The taste is not cheap, not cheap. I think for $16, it could be the best one. I don't like sulfide, but But I, I think, uh, I don't like surprise, but uh, I mean, if I have the money, I would purchase a lot of Louis Boy Law with no sulfur. But if I'm kind of on the low scale, kind of McDonald's guy, no money, working guy, I think it's one of the best ones. Sixteen dollars. I think it's good for New Year, for birthday stuff, for like gathering. It's not shitty really taste, but you don't want to spend a lot. I think it's good. Still, take a look. Still good. Bubbles, this this one is a bubble cure. This one is a bubble cure. Keep going. <laughs> Honestly, I think this one is the longest I've seen. Uh, they have a uh, French, another one, they have a uh, Marie, some kind of Marie with yellow. This one has a lot of bugs. 
and this one too. I think French is actually killing on the bubbles. They kill in Spain and they kill in uh, Italy for the bubbles. This is this is like this is tiny and they keep going. They keep going. They keep going. I'm surprised. This is like it's seriously. It keeps going. I would think you should stop. It doesn't stop. It keeps going. It's like, <laughs> it's like something underneath making bubbles. This is, I think, if you look at bubbles, I think this, the Bussy is the best one. For like, inexpensive sparkling wine. And the taste is not sweet. It's sort of sad, not really sweet, kind of dry, very restrained on sugar. It's kind of nice, but uh, to me, Louis Boileau, it's a little bit higher. Okay, the next one is Saint Rini. Saint Rini or Rini. This is rare. It says Rosé Dry. Rosé Dry. This is French. Product of France. Uh, let's see. I don't see alcohol. Oh, 12 percent. 12 percent alcohol. So French. This one was Saint Train. Uh, $16.99 dollars. $16.99. It's not bad. So let's see, people, let's see. Rosy foil, nice color, rosy. This is Rosé sparkling wine, okay. It says dry, I like dry. Oh, you see, it's holding, it's not gonna fly. Nice smoke. Nice bubbles. But 
frente. Yeah, this is not sweet. This is dry. I think it's okay for $16.99. I think it's a good choice. I think I like a little bit better that one. Uh, which is Debussy. I think I like a little better. Well, Debussy $15.99, but this one $16.99. But I like it. I like both of them. It's, uh, I think it's pretty good. So. pretty good for the price $16.99 it tastes more like close to 25 it's good okay another one is Rondel Cava Rondel Brut this one is Spanish 11.5% alcohol. Product of Spain here. Product of Spain. So, uh, what can I say? Well, it looks dark, but dark blue, extremely dark blue bottle. It's actually nice. I like it. I like I like the color. It looks like sapphire. Anyway, okay, the first bottle was, I have a receipt. The Boosie, $15. Uh, Randell, $10.99, which is cheap. I did like the Boosie. And then I have one more. I don't know, not today, but someday. This is chilled, you see? Sweaty. Uh, chilled overnight. I do like chilled one. You know, there is a belief somewhere like south of Ukraine to open a bottle with knife. And they break that glass. Uh, it's a strange belief. Honestly, I think it's a strange belief. Anyway, there is like a silver color wire and cork. You don't need to... First of all, what you need to do is you need to chill it and don't shake the bottle too much. Then you should be able to remove see I remove it doesn't go anywhere if you don't shake the bottle like crazy it will not go now I need to open I have a towel I like to use towel No glass, nothing. No need to heat glass and break that part. I think it's pretty stupid. Unless you want people to be skeptical. So let's go. I do like French bottles. They have a lot of bubbles. It's pretty good too. But I think uh, it's less. It's less than French sparkling but Somehow they achieve that. A lot of bubbles. 
But this is not bad too. Look, pretty good. I like a lot of bubbles going. Because this is kind of steamy. Yeah, it's pretty good. For, for the bubbles, I like it. Because I had one time Spanish sparkling wine. No, no, no gas, no bubbles. I think this is, this is pretty good. Anyway, let's try it. It's pretty good. Not really cheap taste. But it's it's it says brood, but it's more like sour. To me, this is sour cream brood. It's quite sour. I would expect more sweet than that. But anyway, it's not bad for ten ninety nine. I think I like it. A lot of bubbles. Not bad. 